Welcome back, survivors. Disturb Z here. And we are back in Stranded Deep. Yes, guys, it is still night because our dude is starving and I need to get him some food. And I thought, you know, there's those potatoes that made me sick, but what if we cooked them? Would they still make me sick? Don't know. So I threw one on the fire. As you can see, it's been sitting here forever. And I have no food. So I ran around the island. I found a little bit of crab. I'm going to eat the crab. And then we're probably just going to go to sleep, get up, and see what is going on. Because for some reason, the potato just isn't cooking. And I don't understand why. So, yeah, one of those things. Did a little bit of organizing. We got all of our motor stuff right here. We are missing duct tape and a stick. That is all we need for an actual motor. Trying to just, you know, somewhat keep everything organized. Why do I got two kindlings? Oh, something's done. What is it? Potato? Nope. See, so... Yeah, that makes no sense whatsoever. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to save. We're going to sleep. Hopefully it'll be morning. Yeah, well, it's more than morning. It's like midday here. Is our potato cooked yet? It is. It's a miracle. I got to eat a potato. Why are you doing this, potato? Good. So, potato's gonna cook. We're gonna get us a little bit of water out of a coconut. So, that weird glitch thing happened last night before I started the video, where I had full water, I ran out of food, and all of a sudden I didn't have, uh, I didn't have any water, it's just like my water instantly drained. Now, I don't know if that's like a thing. Because, you know, if it is, that kind of, kind of sucks. Do we not have any? Okay, hold on. Alright, all I needed was the one lashing just in case I find something to complete my raft. Okay, and apparently I got to drag the boat back out. You know, the game's acting almost like there's tides. Which, you know, if that's the case, that is cool, awesome, not going to complain. Let's go to this island over here. I don't know if we've ever been to it. It's a little bit further away, but, you know, we do have the sail. I just, I need to get this other side completed because it keeps trying to turn on me. So hopefully we can get over here without too much problem. And hopefully the island will have something I can use to make the next uh, section. I really don't want to use sticks if I can avoid it. I want like a cool looking raft. 
That's why we're using barrels and buoys and stuff like that. Because I want it to be cool. What is that over there? Something is sticking up out of the water. Under there's shipwreck. I almost guarantee there's a shipwreck there. It's getting choppy. Yep. Sure enough. Okay, just pull up into here. All right, what do we got here that I can take? Tarps, most definitely. A little bit of driftwood, not high priority there. A little barrel. We got some coconuts. We might just have to have us a coconut lunch here in a second. Not exactly uh, in love with having to rely on coconuts for food, but you know, if that is what we have, then that is what we will use. Wow, there is nothing on this island. There's one, there's two crabs. So if I really wanted to, I could crab it up. Okay. <laughs> About the funniest animation I've ever seen. Alright, two coconut halves. We are at... Wow, our dude is red. Okay. Not the best, but certainly not the worst either. Awesome. Food is going back up. Now I'm going to go out here and check out this little wreck. Maybe. If I like this, no, shut the door. No, we're going to die. We shall live with the magic of beans. Oh, Stingray. Okay, that is odd. I can't. Yeah, no, not going to mess with it. Okay. 
Not gonna mess with it. Let's go ahead and get back to the raft. I think what we're gonna do is we got a can of beans, which is awesome. So that's, I wanna say we have another can back at the house. And if that's the case, I'm just gonna grab a handful of coconuts. And we should have a little bit of food for a couple of days. Wow, I just like jumped straight up on the tree. Four coconuts. Come on. There we go. Up the tree we go for the coconuts. All right. Awesome. Any more? Yeah, there's one right there if we can get up the tree. All right. We have lots of coconuts now. And where's my ship? My raft, my ship. Okay, that is the island we want. Luckily, we got a full moon. That'll make sailing a little bit easier. Not the easiest, but a little bit easier. It seems like if we don't spend time doing things at night, the daytime just eats us up. Oh, what in the world is going on? Slow it down. That was odd. My boat almost flipped. So yeah, I don't know if we should be doing stuff at night or if we need to be doing stuff at day. Easy, easy, easy. Stop doing that craziness. Yes. Render in. That means I'm getting close. Oh, there's some big old waves. I've got to get this thing balanced. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow we can get a good balance on here. All right. Where is Mikasa? This is the right island, yeah? Yeah, it is. Good. I always get scared that I'm going to be on the wrong island when I get back. Yay! We got coconuts. We got beans. We got tarps. I don't know how many tarps I can actually put in here. No, 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 put you down. See, now it's all messed up. I'm gonna get yelled at. 
put my beans in there. I'm gonna put my vitamins in there as well. A small bottle of vitamins can be used to treat illness. Hmm. I wonder if that'd give me health back. That I don't know. Not sure, not sure. All right, guys. Well, we're not doing too bad. We are starting to get ourselves a little bit established here. I mean, I got a little bit more food to last. Oh, whatever happened to my potato? Is it... It never cooked. Imagine that. My potato never cooked. Yep. Sometimes I just wonder... Get this fire started get my potato cooking again come on there we go all right running just a little bit low on uh on wood there. Might have to cut down some trees again. Come on, potato. Can I get this potato on there too, please? Haha. -ha. Floating potatoes. I win. I win. You cannot handle my floating potatoes. A little bit odd, but okay. So anyway, like I said, I'm going to use this time to cut trees down. I might start working a little bit more at night, considering that our dude is, like, turning into a lobster. I don't know if that's like a good thing or a bad thing or, you know, how that actually goes. So we're just going to have to try it and see, I guess. Come on, get it chopped up. ever chop up there we go okay what did I do with my hammer I don't remember throwing my hammer down oh yeah I threw it down before we left that's right duh One of these days, I'll remember. No, 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 no. Okay, roofs. That's what I needed. That is what I needed the other day. When I was thinking about the floors, nope, I needed a roof. That is why I don't have... Yeah, okay. Can I disassemble? How do I delete stuff? Yep, nope, have no clue. See, I'm starting to learn how things go together, guys. It's just not... Sometimes it's still not 100% sure... Dude, there are, like, totally four sticks here. Can 
Okay, makes no sense. Makes no sense. No, wait, there it is. Yeah, hammer that sucker. Okay, so now, now we got some shade. Now we can survive the heat, I think. Yes, 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 yes. This shall work, guys. This shall work. Not the greatest of shelters, but you know what? It's working. It is working. So I need to probably chop down more trees, get more sticks, do more things. And yeah, so I think that's pretty much it for today's video. Like I said, I'm gonna chop down this tree I'm going to get it situated. And I might throw up some windows or a doorway or something. Trying to get our little shelter a little bit more protected from the elements. Because I'm not exactly sure how much that stuff is going to affect us right now. So, I do know it does look like our guys getting sunburned really bad so I might do another video of where we stay out of the Sun maybe do another one where we do a lot of stuff at night I mean it's not too dark so that's always a good thing as long as it doesn't get too dark and if it does that's when we bust out the flashlight But, yeah, so that'll do it for today's video, guys. Do hope everybody has enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button. It's an awesome way for you to show your support to me, to the channel, to the video, and to the game itself, guys. And as always, feel free to share the video on any social media you're using. And, guys, I'd just like to stop. Take a moment to thank each and every one of y'all for all of your wonderful, awesome support, all the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared, guys. It is awesome. I do appreciate it. And with that being said, until next time, survivors, keep on surviving.